How you doing guys? This is Hybrid Steel. Welcome to Mon Bazoo. So, what have I been doing for the last, well, I would say about a week. So, I, I record my videos in bundle. We're good. Uh, it gives me a little bit of time to faff around with stuff. So, we're actually on our, like, another load of maple syrup. That's all ready to go. It's Sunday. I can't trade it. It's all good. So, what I've been doing is I've sorted out my garage a bit more. So, all of my tables are a bit more and more aligned. All my parts are all a bit, basically, I just had time. I bought one of these things then went, oh yeah, they need rims. So, I can't put those on there because I put tires on them, which sort of sucks but apart from that we're all good also i've got to be making a once in a lifetime trip over to the mainland i need to go and sell a massive amount of um stuff which is good but i figured i was going to do this all on a monday so i'm going to take this to the shop come back and then i've got to take all of this to the dealer so that should be fun because people kept telling me have you unlocked your bunker yet have you unlocked your bunker i was like does that involve going to the mainland and talking to the people over in the big building they went yeah that's it i have never been there so I'm going to risk it and take my car there. I think some of it's off-road, which does suck, so it's going to be a fun little trip. Apart from that, we're all good. I did have a couple of days where I had a really bad time, where you know when you pay your electricity bill in this game, and then all of a sudden your electricity bill just disappears, it doesn't go in the post box. That happened to me. So for a couple of days I was running off my generator, which sort of sucked. So I wasn't able to produce maple syrup. I'm getting paid, I think it's about 10, 12 grand every Sunday now, which is good. Hence why I'm up to $41,000. I only have 160 grand to go before we can pave the road and do all the other stuff. Because I want to get all that done first before I even customise my truck. The truck is going to be like the cherry on top. It's going to be that one thing that I strived all of this hardness to get there and I'm finally done sort of thing. So this is going to be cooking up. This is going to be full very soon, which is good. And these will last for the weekend. We should be fine. So Monday, we got a lot to do. Monday is going to be a good, fun day. Oh, it's another 22 grand in the bank. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, so since the last time I spoke to you, which for you was probably a couple of seconds ago, I've done a little bit of delivering, done a little bit of parceling. I'm just, I'm just going to make sure that I've got everything ready to go. So I'm just making sure that these are not messed around with because they can get infected when they're outside. So it's all good. They're not infected. I think they've got about until mid. Actually, you know what? If I if I water them now, I don't have to water them later. Brilliant. Okay. Right. Let's go and put this back in my truck. So it's Sunday. I'm not sure about if the dealer's open on Sundays, and I don't really want to go all the way over there just to go. Oh, I've got to go back home. So I'm going to hang around here for another day. I'm going to grow my plants out for a little bit more, and then we've got a long trip ahead of us. We're driving to the mainland with the car. We're driving to the maple syrup place with our canister of maple syrup, basically because we're just making money now. As said, when, when I start grinding into this game again, I basically go into grind mode. So since the last point you saw me and this point, there's been an increase of 22,000, nearly 30 grand in my bank account because I've done three trips with this and I just made 20 grand overnight because it's Sunday and I get paid all my royalties and maple syrup. So that's good. Downside is poutine. I haven't got any more poutine. Actually, oh, I do have poutine. That's good. Right, so I do need to buy some more cheese. I do need to buy some... I have got a ton of potatoes. It's mainly just cheese. Actually, you know what? I could go and get some cheese now. I don't really want to take the cars, though. I don't really want to go out, because going out just means I have to drive places. I suppose we actually better... You know what? Let's go and get some poutine. And, well, some cheese, and then we can make some... I like having options for driving. So the main reason why I'm not spending my money like everybody else when they went off and the first thing everybody did in this game was I'm going to go and buy the truck. I'm going to go and buy all the parts. I'm on the road. I think the downside to this guy is you have to literally crouch just to throw anything in the passenger seat. This is the only car that I really wanted to bring out because the other ones I'm loading up with um, herbs and the other one I'm loading up with maple syrup. So I haven't really got enough time to like mess around with all this. Right, home we go, and then I'm going to explain my choices. Okay, so that's four bags of cheese. Let me just go and get my potatoes now, because we've got loads. So what I've been doing is I've been grinding this game up for about, I don't know, when was the last time I made a video about this? About four days. I've been basically sitting here, playing this game, grinding money, which is why I can now earn like 22 grand every Sunday. And I'm going to keep doing this until I've got the money I need. I need 200,000 just to complete all the paving and the concreting, right? Then I need, say, like another 40 grand to buy all the customizations for the truck. Now, I know I'm only going to use a few of them, but I want them all because I'm a hoarder. 
because I'm a little bit OCD and I've got space in my garage to put more things. So that's why I want it all. So yeah, it's going to cost me about 40 grand to buy everything and then it's going to cost me uh, 200 grand to buy all the roads. This is the most annoying part about delivering maple syrup. i got to wait until it opens now. I can't remember if it opens at 8. Yes, okay, 8 o'clock. Okay, so maple syrup's delivered for the day, that's all good. I'm going to go and park this up at the sugar shack and then we're going to take the car to the other place, which is on the mainland. That's all we're going to do now. That's, that's, I just, I've, been, I've been grinding out that for a couple of weeks in this game, as in like in-game weeks, not in like my real weeks. If I'd been doing this for weeks, I'd have, I'd have loads of money. So yeah, the only downside I would find I find with the truck with this giant tank on the back is reversing. Now, being I filled all up around my tr all my cabin with uh, trees, it's a little bit harder to get in there with the truck. So I have to sort of reverse it up. I don't always get this right the first time. Let's put it that way. All right, and that'll fill up all day. Maybe it'll be ready by Wednesday, uh, Tuesday. So tomorrow. I'm not going to be recording it for you, but tomorrow, in game days, I might be able to do another delivery. So that just means I'm clocking up the cash ready for the next one. So instead of earning 22 grand on Sunday, I might earn like 25 grand on Sunday. So that's all good. Oh, and I've also got to go and check out my brother's place. Apparently there's something down the side there for me. I didn't know. There's all these little things they've added, that Santa Goat's been adding into the game that I just wasn't aware of. So I've already taken the sledge. That was a pain in the bum to find. Oh, just had an accident. It's all good. I will survive. Let's go. Mainland, here we come. Now I've got to remember where to go. I know it's some dirt road that I've got to go down. I can't remember where it is, though. I think that's the road, isn't it? Bit of a bumpy one, this one. And here we are. So I don't know how many I had to bring with me. The minimum we buy is 27 packs. Jeebus. Can I go in here now? How you doing guys? <laughs> Big electric compost machine. Huge packaging machine. Start the construction of the bunker is 40 grand. Oh cool, and new wheels as well, fantastic. This is a really fun place to be, man. This is like, hey, I'm like, well, cool. Upgrade the French fry press, nice. Okay, so what I need to do then is I need to raise 200, I need to raise $300,000, bargain. So thank you very much to all those people out there who commented that I need to unlock the, bang, the bunker as well. I now need to add more money to my fund. Thanks, guys. All right, so I've got 70 grand. I need to make $230,000. Isn't that just bloody amazing? So what I'm going to be doing for the next while is um, I'm going to be grinding out earning money again. I mean, at the rate that I'm earning, it's not too bad, but it's still a... It's still quite a lot of cash. So yeah, basically what you've seen is how I'm earning money. This is how I'm doing this. I'm not... The only time I'm going to use mods is basically just so I can just grind up the time with like... I can sit there for a bit and just have infinite like um, maple syrup and infinite this. It just means I don't have to worry about messing around with too much stuff. But I, I mean, even as you can see right now, I haven't got infinite on now. I just thought I'd do this video and I've got to turn the mods on. But most of the time I play this without mods for when it comes to videos and stuff. But when it comes to the grinding section in the background, I'd rather just focus on growing the stuff I need to, getting the maple syrup I need to, all without messing around with like trying to survive, basically. I know this is a light survival game. Very, very light. I mean, it's almost like a Muller light. But it's, it's, it's a decent little game. I just don't like having to keep looking after myself. Ah, uh, all maple syrup up and ready to go. All right, cool. So that was fun. Uh, we've now opened up the giant barn. I've now got to grow all my stuff. We've got 61% on these. So these got another like three to four days. You can grow one harvest every week, which is quite nice. I might get these ones done by Friday, and then I can replant for the weekend. And then I'll just keep chucking it in the back of the car, ready to just take out to the next place. 
and then I've just got to keep making sure that the maple syrup is flowing just gonna keep it going having 250 odd trees attached to that thing you can fill it up once a day maybe once every other day and then when it obviously at the weekends because you're just going to be firing up the maple syrup and not actually delivering it because you can't it'll fill up over the weekend and it's it's fun don't worry so we've got about half that'll be finished by tomorrow as it's on auto boil and then um yeah so by the end of this week in the in game i should be earning around 28 to thirty thousand dollars on sunday which is be welcome because that puts me up to a hundred grand so that's what my plan and my plan uh, we're going to be spending nearly half a million dollars in one day when i've saved up that much money that will be a big video there's going to be so much going on in it i hope to have you along for that ride hey and before you go stop stop, 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 stop. hit the hit the next video you might enjoy it you might like it it might open your eyes up to a new video game so thank you very much for coming this has been Ivory Steel if you have enjoyed this video hit that like subscribe and notification button below for all other updates and I'll be back here with a brand new video live stream or whatever else I do on this channel until then I appreciate it for your time thank you very much for kicking by peace out have fun enjoy everything you guys do bye bye for now